welcome this is the energy vibration um reading for the um last week of august the fifth week of august 2017 i'm sorry it's uh, <laughs> i'm trying to get these out so um thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful support thank you for um you know really um coming together with me thank you for all the messages that are so beautiful thank you if you guys know how many messages I receive per week it is so wonderful I got a beautiful message from someone who has said I was you know going through something and your message just helped me to bring positivity into my life thank you so much for these wonderful messages and I want to say to each and every person out there I'm grateful that you have come back every week every month to, to support my channel and um, I'm hoping to do a live on um, Thanksgiving Day which uh, or you no know, Labor Day I'm not sure but Thanksgiving Day I'm open to do a live so I'm hoping that you will be uh, with um, be sharing that day with me okay um, this is the energy vibration reading for the Leo's who are having a birthday so hold on hold on hold on yes but I think it's the Leo's that are having birthday because I have been so busy I am terribly busy I am having I'm going through so many things and doing so many things so let's look yes it's is the energy vibration of uh, the Virgos because it is going to be the 28th of August until the 3rd of September so this is the week that is going to be the 23rd the 28th of August until the 3rd of September so we are celebrating the Virgos birthday oh my god congratulations you Virgos um this is the time when the energy of Mercury comes in and uh, you are governed by the um, planet of Mercury um, and this is positive because this is a wonderful endeavor so this is the week of the moon the week begins from the 28th until the 3rd of September congratulations to all you Virgos it's going to be um, a wonderful um, birthday week it's going to be a positive an extremely positive birthday week and this is going to be wonderful the energy of the moon is you know your intuition um, awaken you to certain things and on the card it says the power of the power of the enemies seems stronger than it really is. The power of the enemies seems stronger than it really is. This is a week that some people are going to really feel that way. Okay, this is something that is going to help you to begin your 2017 birthdays. Okay, so you're for the people who were born on the 28th of August until the 3rd of September, the energy of the moon is going to heal you through this year of 2017 because you are now um, starting your year 2017. Okay. And the power of the enemy seems stronger than it really is. Okay, so here we are. We're going to go in your reading. We're going to take a look at what energies um, you birthday people have for this week. So uh, let's uh, go through and see what is coming up for you birthday people. Wonderful situation. Things are happening. For you birthday people this is going to be positive this is going to be good oh, oh my gosh I said it it is it is going to be um, a, um, a year for you people but everyone who was born between um, the um, time of uh, um, the 28 the 28 uh, all who was born um, between the time of the 28 of uh, um, August 28th of August oh my gosh this is so beautiful it's it's absolutely beautiful I've been seeing this coming up and it's just so positive so good whatsoever is going on here it is positive okay 
wonderful 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 let's look at these um, situation for for you people there is going to be a lot a lot of uh, um, promotions there is going to be a lot of success there is going to be um, positive positive situation coming out uh, for all you people who were born between um, the um, August 28th and September 3rd okay so there is going to be a lot of bringing balance into your world because your intuition via your intuition because you think that the enemy is stronger than you but being bringing balance in your world some people are going to uh, um, be very successful some people are going to have a lot of achievements some people are going to um, people are going to start be aware of them um, positive positive situation and energy is coming in your life in whatever reason it's going to be for a lot of you for you're going to become a father okay so let's move on and look at the people who were born on the 28th of August happy birthday to you and you have this energy to carry you throughout the whole year and we and you are going to be working with the energy of the wheel of fortune there we go there we go there we go ladies and gentlemen boys and girl if your birthday is on the 28th of August you have the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune and this is a fantastic fantastic energy vibration to begin your year a new year because your year 2007 begins after your birthday okay after your birthday begin the year 2017 for you guys because you are born um, different times and different uh, here the general readings is that it's uh, the the year is on but you guys know it anyway so congratulations you have the energy of the wheel of fortune and what does it say it says uh, the ring bring beneficial but eventually um, demonstrate one ring to rule them all one ring to rule them all okay I should say I haven't said it to you guys so what tarot deck I'm using the tarot deck of uh, the Lord of the ring and uh, I'm not sure if a lot of people is aware of it but it is uh, the tarot deck uh, the Lord of the Rings star deck okay so this is what I am using so here we go so whatever is happening you have the energy vibration of the wheel of fortune and what's coming with the wheel of fortune there is a message coming in the message that is coming in in this year and the movement for a lot of people in this year is going to be ambitious you all will be moving in an ambition way a very ambitious way whatever is happening you're moving towards your goal and you're moving towards what you, you want to achieve in this year so this is going to be extremely extremely positive and we are going to have a little conflicts in this year but it's good because conflicts um, clear whatever the energies because some people will have a situation of uh, you know you're not feeling um, so good with a situation but yet still you um, don't say anything and there is going to be conflicts uh, whatever the conflicts is you are going to be moving through this because it says uh, um, the power of the enemy seems stronger than it really is okay so whatever the conflicts is just um, move away from that okay as we move forward and we're looking at the people who were born on the 29th of August if I can pick these cards up the 29th of August happy birthday and you have the energy vibration of justice whatever the situation is you are going to be justified you are going to come out of a situation the winner okay whatever the situation whatever situation you were going through for some people who had legal um, situations in their life uh, legal um, court cases and all that sort of a things so whatever that was there you're going to come out on top you're going to win this situation and come out on top and it says uh, uh, I'm trying to read it. It says the outbreakers of the dawn I could represent the abandonment of the past mistake. So this is good. You know, overcoming justice is really 
and abandonment of a past mistake so congratulations for you people who were born on the 29th because whatever situation that was unjust is going to bring balance and then the Sun new energy new things successful events are going to be coming in so whatever you're going to be justified you're going to be winning whatever injustice that has done been done to you whatever court cases that you are going through whatever legal matters you are you have been going through you are both going to win this if you are a couple and you have been going through serious situations uh, um, you know injustice from people and that sort of a thing you are going to overcome this okay if you were someone who have been in justice um, asked for you are going to win this again I'm saying to you guys there's really the angels and guides are coming in to give messages because I constantly it's like once out of every week since the month of July that I'm getting these double energy so two times the Sun comes up so for you um, for you um, people who were born on the 29th of August uh, please all the energy vibration of 31 use the number 31 in this year and for 31 and 4 okay so you have 11 which is a gateway a partway which is opening to positive energy positive situation success um, a lot of success but a lot of help is coming in from the source of all things so your universal angels and spirit guides will be with you because 3 plus 1 is 4 and you have 4 to 4 twice and you have 30 31 twice okay so number four and number 31 work with these two numbers in this year as we move forward we have the energy vibration on the 30th of August the 30th of August we have the energy vibration of the world congratulations so you see um i've told you this is an uh, an earth energy element and what is happening with this earth energy element is that it is supporting you it is going to support you throughout the the year 2017 because your year 2017 begins after your birthday so it says middle earth where we live in or uh, where we live our lives and in the west the um bernard glanzo so whatever is happening the angels the guides the spirits the um ascendance from middle earth is going to help you virgos because you virgos are hurt sign people this is the energy vibration of the world and whatever energies because i was just pushed to use these cards nobody else have used them i think people don't like them but i i i, I personally think this is my first time i'm going to try them out see how it goes and now i can understand because they have a different meaning they have um the spirit world is working through these cards and this is what we don't understand because each card have different sort of energy because whatever um, the beams uh, that is working with that person who um, designed these cards always uh, bring in what they need to be done if you see the working on these cards these are all pattern whole working a lot of secrets uh, corner so it's obviously a spiritual of uh, someone from a different solar group uh, or a uh, yeah, galactic group that gave them the information to design these cards so each card they could have a different different meaning what is happening if for you um, Virgos it's going to be positive it's going to be wonderful good situations are coming in for you Virgos if you are connected with um, someone who is uh, um, the king of sword who is an Aquarius um, a Gemini or a, a Libran this is going to be one of this uh, um, positive energy because he's going to come in and help and he is going to come in as a psychic person and help he's gonna really come in as a psychic person and help you out of a situation this is the love of your life this person really truly loves you so if you're looking for a relationship you are going to meet someone who is an Aquarian a Gemini of a Libran I'm seeing more a Libran for um, whoever is there but anyway it's it's the air sign of either Gemini um, 
Aquarius or Libran person he is a psychic person and he's truly in love with you all he has in here is heart for you is love okay so whoever this person is he is really in love with you and all that he has for you is really love true love okay okay that was the the 28 29 30 so we're going to the last day of August the people who were born on the 31st day of August and we have the Emperor the Emperor so this is what I'm saying congratulations happy birthday you have the energy vibration of the Emperor who is going to help you throughout this entire year I remember your year birthday begins um, and the day after your birthday so that's when 2017 the year 2017 begins for you because you were just finishing off 2016 so let's look at this in a positive way a lot of you are going to be achievers a lot of you guys are going to be achievers a lot of you guys are going to find the creativity within you and the work the positive work that you have been doing you are going to learn new skills a lot of you people and it goes embo refuse to um, touch the ring and thus retain his uh, independency okay so this is good because uh, some of you are going to re re refuse um, to do the mundane things that people expect you you know things that um, like yeah you must do this or you must do that and, and you're going to choose to um, start working for yourself start doing something for yourself start being independent and don't depend on the mundane world and this is going to be um, very very positive so uh, this is what I'm saying um, you people are going to be extremely successful because it's the second time the energy vibration of uh, the hamper uh, uh, comes up and this is a positive positive card the energy of the emperor is always positive it's always that you're trying to build your life in a, a different way you're always trying to bring positivity in your life you're always trying to bring balance and a new situation in your life and this is extremely extremely good so I want to say to each and every person out there um, your year 2017 is going to be wonderful you have the energy of the five of ones in reverse so whatever the conflict was whatever situation that there was and whatever the conflicts was it is now in reverse and this is a good situation especially for the men if you had what relationship that was um, conflicting situation it is now over and um, this is um, this for the men um, this is a situation where you had conflicting situation of your work you had a work situation um, conflicts and that sort of a thing um, people were going at each other it is now it has now come to an end there is no um, losing your job or anything like that you just stand up to whatever that was being injustice to you and it's going to be working out okay all right um for the men also again there is going to be whoever is looking for their twin flame or soulmate um you are going to find this person via the energy vibration of a leo Leo uh, uh, Aries of a Sagittarius okay so if you have been looking for a partner your soulmate is coming through the energy vibration of an uh, a Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius this is very positive it's going to be a positive year for you most of you are going to be working with these fire sign people in business and for the women whatever the situation was in your life and whatever conflicts there was um, a lot of you women are going to be achievers a lot of you women are going to finally find balance in your life so this is going to be wonderful it's affecting the men as well as the women but there was a special message for the men so congratulations you have the energy of the Emperor the energy of the Emperor is good because you'll be working towards something which is going to be very positive in your life okay so this is very very good okay as we move on we have the energy happy birthday to the people who were born on the 1st of September you have the energy of judgment and it is a good good energy whatever is happening um, the energy of judgment came up and yeah I kept my glasses on because I wanted to read the energy of judgment it's going to be positive it's going to be positive okay as you see and depict in this picture 
golf of reveal the to photo the the natural um, of the the force of around him the force around him so again um, Gandalf reveal to photo the natural of the force around him so this is wonderful for you people who were born in September. Yeah, I'm sorry. I love the <laughs> the Lord of the Rings. I've read the book. I've watched the movie so many times. And I, yeah, I'm so connected with the mystical world and that sort of a thing. So I remember this scene. So this is good because whatever is happening for you guys, there is a force that is coming in, a powerful force. And this can be the energy vibration of your guiding angels and your spirit guides who are coming in, a powerful force. And it is true because you have the energy of the bear here so the energy of the bear is always powerful force coming in what you have is three times three is nine one ten you have the ten of cups so it's going to be wonderful wonderful your family um, um, people around you are going to be supporting you and there is going to be a wonderful positive positive energy and uh, situation in your life so this is going to be extremely good this is going to be wonderful whatever the situation is it's going to be um, a, a beautiful beautiful 2017 for you guys because you're seeing that the power around you is going to protect you in this year from whatever situation it's all about the family it's all about emotion because you have the energy of the ten of cups with this positive so this year is going to consist of positive things you're going to be and helping your family in um, a positive way you're going to be the force the energies the universal energies are going to come in in the year 2017 so remember that 2017 for you begins after the day after your birthday so that will be the 2nd of September um 2017 until the the um, uh, 1st of September 2018 so now is your year of 2017 it's beginning okay wonderful 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 um wonderful as we look at the people who are having birthdays on the 2nd of september congratulations happy birthday you have the energy of the empress and this is good this is a powerful powerful time for you guys you have the energy of the mother figure the feminine and also the masculine so you people are very blessed to be having because your cups people some of you vibrate with the energy vibration of uh, um, the Leos and some of you vibrate with the energy vibration of uh, um, um, yeah the Leos so what is happening is that this is a powerful time because the Empress comes in whatever situation and you can read the message on the card there whatever situation that has been happening three aspect of the feminine power is going to come in for the men and women who were born on the 2nd of September so whatever you feel three aspect of the feminine power is going to come in in this year see oh my gosh okay all right okay I'm sorry I'm amazed at myself sometimes <laughs> it's not really it's the channel that, oh my gosh this is super cool okay let's explain this to you okay um, I'm, I'm some sometimes I'm really surprised honestly people the three aspect of your feminine side is going to come in and there you're going to work together because here it is the three also the three of Pentacles and then you're going to work together with these aspect of these situation okay and what is going to happen is that you're going to bring these three aspects of this feminine side and this is going to affect the men women boys and girls out there we all carry the masculine and feminine side um, in our lives so yes it's going to affect us so whatever the situation is you are going to have the energy vibration of the three aspect of the femininity working with you in this year and what is going to happen is that a lot of people are going to find the right true friends coming in your life whatever the situation is you are going to find these people supporting you and coming in your life and so, um, protecting you in your life and bringing out wonderful new experience so if you have been looking for a soul group soul friends you are going to find them just coming up in your life another thing that is happening is that 
if you decide to work on a project within um, three persons or two persons it's going to be wonderful and it's going to be a prosperity um, um, focus a lot of new people are uh, people are going to be entering your life and bringing in positive energies in your life okay so this is going to be good for you guys as we move on to the last 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 um, we have the energy of the three third of September you have the energy of the fool so whoever you are that was born on the third of September you are going on a new journey okay the new journey do not um, read the message on the card, but do not uh, feel as if this man because going on a new journey is always something that is better by a pool of water considering the many possibilities open to him okay so you are now being and standing by a pool of water whatever is this pool of water wherever you are but you are about to, to dream and consider and ponder on the many positive openings uh, to you okay so this is going to be a wonderful year so this is going to be a year of planning going on a new journey and you have the energy of the star yes 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 so whatever decision if you have thought I want to move because maybe if I move I'm going to be positive I'm going to be good at something I'm going to be going in a new direction yes your wishes and dreams whatever you sit to decide and ponder on the different possibilities of things it's going to be happening for you it's going to be happening and it's going to be happening in a wonderful wonderful way okay so remember um, this is going to affect uh, the masculine and feminine side of you okay for the men a lot of men are going to be very successful in this year whatever the uh, you are going for whatever you're working towards a lot of men are going to be successful and a lot of women their dreams your wishes and dreams are going to be coming through so congratulations again ladies and gentlemen boys and girls uh, this is going to be a very successful year for you um, Virgos so energy of the fool is a positive energy because it's bringing you to some place that is uh, um, very very good very wonderful okay um, trying to make sure because this week is a week where um, the energy of um, um, I didn't have much time I brought out the monthly readings so if you haven't um, check out the monthly readings please check out the monthly readings and um, I want to say thanks to a lot of people out there a lot of people who have been supporting my channel and support you know asking for reading I could be able to get new cards so you're gonna see the new cards coming out so thank you I think it's the channel was um, on 8 the 18th of August was uh, uh, when I begin uh, my channel so um, a lot of wonderful things are happening since the 18th of August so my channel had birthday and he got some gifts so we'll be all sharing that with you guys okay let's see I'm using the uh, um, the source card and it says spark of the vine I recognize the divine spark within me and recognize I am part of all creations isn't this wonderful yes it is I um, reunite the divine spark within me and recognize that I'm part of a collection of creative and this is good this is good because look at that it's as if your heart chakra is ill and it begins to spark and you're you are walking with a glow around you and wherever you go this divine spark of the spark of the vine is going to heal whatever place you place your foot on so I reignite the divine spark within me and recognize I am a part of all creation it is so and it will be and I would advise you to say this three times and say it is so and it will be because you are an earth energy person you're an earth energy vibration and you came here to heal the hurt remember this is going to be your weeks um, 
um, affirmation and say it three times and said it is so and it will be at the end as we move on and using um, this is one of the gifts from the channel and it is the angel of abundancy and this is from the rain virtue and let's see what you guys have pay yourself first pay yourself first make yourself most important okay make yourself your first most important financial obligation by setting aside a pro a portion of your incomes every time you are paid this loving form of self-care ensure that you will have savings to invest in your present and your future okay all right you know this is wonderful <laughs> this is so wonderful this this is wonderful I just said it to you guys that um, I you know thank you for the sharing with me and for the, all the people who have asked for readings and so because um, my channel on the 18th of August uh, um, it was uh, my channel's birthday and look at this uh, it says pay yourself first and this is it um, <laughs> it's amazing so for you guys, I guess this is a message for you guys to let you know. Pay yourself first, okay? Pay, make yourself the most important financial obligation by setting aside a portion of your incomes every time uh, you are paid. The loving, the known um, form of self care ensure that you will have a, to simply invest in your present okay and your future so this is wonderful i'm saying to you guys come back look at this card read it and i'm saying to you namaste have a wonderful birthday until next time